Because of the random pattern of a lot of isolated showers, they've been really a nuisance to a lot of folks having plans over the weekend. But right now at our dry deck, Tech camera is indicating we're looking clear there in Ocean City and 78 degrees. Our headlines, more isolated storms are expected, but cooling off drastically. We're still tracking Lee in the Atlantic. And it's changing in its size and strength. And we're expecting, believe it or not, below norm temps. Hey, now that's a change. Okay, so we see on live radar, most of the scatter showers are moving from the south to the north at this present time and staying relatively scattered. I mean, we have it connected to a trough that's moving and we have that general flow that's coming out of the south. So we're looking at hit and miss showers that are likely to pop in one side of the neighborhood and not be in the other. But in the wake of all that, dropping some heavy downpours in isolated pockets. For example, nearly a half an inch for us at our official Georgetown site, but just over a quarter of an inch in Ocean City and Salisbury. But when we break it down even more locally for you, we've had over two inches in Del Mar, close to that in Bridgeville, over an inch and a half in Millsboro in the last 24 hours now, just over a half an inch, two and a half an, an inch and a half in Stockley, and just under an inch and a half in Harbison, and Rehoboth Beach uh, over an inch and a quarter. Now with the temperature change, it's not been dramatic because we've cooled down since yesterday, dramatically from let's say last week, Temperatures in the 70s for right now. The UV index is going to stay at about 7 for the next couple of days, so you're going to need to be sure uh, to wear that sunblock. Monday, we see spot showers flaring up quickly. Tuesday, we'll start off and we'll end up in the 80s. So we're looking at it being a little bit cooler. But speaking of Tuesday, we're looking for a flaring up of scattered showers in excess of an inch for us in Georgetown, Millsboro, and possibly uh, down towards Bethany Beach with our future rain. Because once again, very spotty in pattern is what we're expecting. Hurricane Lee, now moving to the west-northwest, eight miles per hour, sustained winds, 120, and we're looking forward to go from a category three back to a four, and it's had a serious ebb and flow to it. But I wanna take a look at something that's being, become very interesting. You see, this coming, this convergence, what's happening right here, this is acting as a barrier for us, according to what we're expecting Friday morning. And look at what the storm track is looking like it's going to do. Track away from us and continue to lift towards the north and leave us alone with a direct hit, but still watching out for dangerous, possible dangerous riptides. Here's a look at your Paul Davis restoration and home remodeling extended forecast. A little stormy Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday, but much cooler and calmer after Wednesday.